This week on WHS in a Minute, we took a deep look at Chromebooks and the Latino Choir. As a digital learning teacher, what do you do around the school? Here at the high school, I'm here helping with uh, passing out the Chromebooks to all the incoming students, grades 9 through 12. I'm also here to help any student that already has a Chromebook. They can drop it off here at my office and uh, I'll work on repairing or getting it out for repairs if they need it. But beyond Chromebooks, I'm here to help with uh, logging into any email or portal um, issues that students might have. Um, other than that, I'm here helping the teachers to get more technology into the classrooms. If you already had a Chromebook and you needed it fixed, uh, you come right into my office. Uh, right outside there's a, uh, an iPad with a pink crate. Uh, you just fill out the, the Google form that asks you some simple information such as your name um, and what grade you're in. Uh, and then you tell me what the problem is and you just drop it into the, the pink crate and then as soon as it's fixed I'll give you a call and I'll, we'll get it right back to you. All right, so if a new student hasn't gotten their Chromebook yet, how do they get one? It's very important that the new student fill out the paperwork first. So if you, you are a new student, um, then you should definitely come in, see our friendly librarian staff, and get their paperwork. Um, they can just come on in. We have some folders. Pick it up, sign it, and return it, and we'll get started on that process right away. These are this week's upcoming events. I was able to catch up with Miss Sincotta and the Latino Choir. How did this class come about? It was actually created, to my knowledge, it was created by Doug Trudeau, the Director of Fine Arts, and I'm sure he had a team that put it together with him. I actually wasn't a part of it, and then I was told I was teaching this class and became really excited. Well, as our um, Latino population has increased, we wanted to find an outlet for them um, musically. So we came up with the idea of introducing a Latino choir. This year we are off to a great start with a fantastic amount of kids that are extremely talented and musical. So I'm very, very excited. Um, I chose to take this class because I speak English and Spanish, but um, I want to understand Spanish more and I really like Spanish songs. I chose to take this class because I am, my whole family is Hispanic and I love music, so I wanted to get more connected with my mute, my roots with, by something I love. Porque necesito uh, cantar en español y porque me gusta cantar mucho. Tell us about some of your performances. We will have four performances this year, and they will all be in either the Waltham High School Auditorium or the Waltham High School Lobby. And the first one is our fall concert on October 18th. 